Alright, it's time for the second stage. By the way, I just started playing the uh, Resident Evil 5 Mercenaries. Fucking hell is it hard. But it's that weird kind of hard where you can't really hurt most people. Like, most people take a very large amount of damage, so you gotta you only get points for the ones you kill, and but in order to compensate for that they made the standards higher and a lot of the mini bosses give you more health. Which doesn't necessarily work for some of them, like Mr. Execution Man with a giant mallet slash guillotine thing. Because they take like an absurdly high amount of damage. Uh and I, I don't think I'm going to make videos for that, because there's just too many characters. I haven't even unlocked all of them. The only one I unlocked was Sheva Clubbin, because I have not been able to get A rating in any location except for one. I almost did today, though. But I had to stop playing, because someone had to watch a movie. That's what I get for not buying a freaking 25-foot Ethernet cable to actually put the freaking Xbox in my room instead of my brother's. So anyway, I'm talk, uh, talking off top of here. Yeah. Wesker with his falcon punch. And yeah! It's actually interesting. That kick does not actually kill them. Oh shit, I'd probably get away. Uh, the kick does actually not does not kill the people who wear helmets. It probably should, but it doesn't. Um, but it pro but any any like pretty much any shot after that though will kill them. Like, I'm pretty sure it will anyway. I guess it doesn't. Oh, crap. Uh, Alright, I used a flash grenade here. Didn't help against something that's flying, though. And fucking hell, guy was getting up. So I decided to use up another one. And it really doesn't matter, because these things crowd up your inventory space. And the problem with Wesker's is the, uh, Wesker's thing is, Wesker's attack is that when you, uh, when you use it, uh, the enemy goes all over the place, but the but the enemies but the other enemies don't take damage from that force, so uh, you, they may end up waking up if you hit them with a uh, flash grenade or something. So anyway, with a distinct lack of a knife, I had to sniper the frickin' barrels open. Anyway, open, getting everything up. By the way, I would recommend Resident Evil 5. I just wouldn't expect the highest of uh, of you know expectations with it. Holy shit! Whoa, running away. Well, I'm surprised they didn't follow me. I'm surprised they didn't make uh, Garador in um, Resident Evil 5. They recycled a lot in Resident Evil 5. There's a freaking El Gigante in there. And for some reason, he's a million times tougher. You use Gatling guns against him and he doesn't die. I really should just take out the Magnum. And... Yeah, I just realized that I had the Magnum. Ownage. Alright, now I'm moving on to the pistol again with this quick reloadingness. Alright, uh, take care of everyone. Get some nice headshots. This game is substantially easier to aim in, primarily just because it's on the Wii. Um, but I have. Well, actually, I can see a way that they could make RE5 on the, on the Wii. It's just kind of hard and overcomplicated in terms of controls. Alright, now moving on. And... Come on, dammit. Alright. Ah! Couldn't find the enemies to kill, so now I gotta run out of freaking time. You killed my streak! Alright, reloading the magnum bullets. I still got like six left. And now apparently I have a lot of people firing arrows at me. Holy shit, too close. I was hoping I took out that zeal off, but apparently I did not. Fucking archers. Still, the archers here are an improvement compared to the archers in RE5, who can be overly accurate, like to the most ridiculous consent. And motherfuckers. Alright, anyway, punched. Alright, so now, got the 90 seconds. And 30 second bonus time. I swear, the bonus time they give you in RE5 is only like, is like 20 seconds or 10 seconds, because it's really not that long, and it only seems to ever last like one combo. Alright, so now taking care of the archers, and take care of them quite nicely. Alright, now shield the guy, that guy, 
There's always one person who starts running like crazy, even if you cut off his head with the log, I think. There he is! But luckily I took him out. Ah, fucking archers. Thankfully, they, they, thankfully, all the all the mercenaries levels are pretty original. By the way, there's a lot more mercenaries levels in uh, in RE4. There's like six, I think, or eight. Oh, damn it, another flagger. All right, moving right along. I'm up to the forty thousand mark. All right, so doing quite nice for myself. Managed to kill them by shooting them in the shoulder, in the elbow. Like fucking hell. Alright. Come on. At least this game doesn't have She Bitch. Or Shiva. She's an absolute dumb shit in the first in the first player, but the game is incredibly fun co-op. Oh damn it, close up. I gotta run. Gotta run, gotta run now. Gotta run, gotta run now. That's Riley. Whoa. And I can't stop them in the ground. I wanted to keep my feet. Why do I keep saying that? I'm not even playing Zelda or anything. 